How to get rid of the USB accessories disabled error on your Mac? Reconnect your USB accessories. If you're having trouble with your connected USB devices, the first thing you should try is to reconnect them. Unplug all accessories from the USB ports and after a few seconds, plug them back in. If you're still having issues and don't know which accessory might be the culprit, disconnect one by one and check if the error disappears. Use a different USB port. Another thing you can try to do is to connect the USB device to another port. Maybe the current port is damaged, and that's why the connection keeps on failing. If the problem is gone when you connect the device to another port, get your damaged port checked out. Check all the USB ports and accessory cables. Check all the USB ports and cables of each connected device. After some time, dust and other debris accumulate in the USB ports, which can result in the device not connecting or not being detected. Carefully check the ports and clean their insides. We recommend using a small precision tool for best results. If the USB ports are clean, check the cables of the accessories. Restart your Mac. The USB accessories disabled error could have occurred due to a glitch or an error in the software that appeared during the session. A restart will get rid of any minor bugs and glitches and clear out your Mac's temporary memory. Update your Mac. Click on the Apple logo and select System Preferences. Then, go to Software Update. Wait while your Mac searches for updates. If found any, click on Update Now. Reset System Management Controller on your Mac. The System Management Controller is responsible for managing certain parts of your Mac's hardware like the battery, USB accessories, etc. Resetting the SMC might help you get rid of the error related to the USB accessories. This method is for Intel-based Macs only. To reset the SMC on your Mac, visit our guide linked below for more information. Reset Parameter Random Access Memory or Non-Volatile Random Access Memory. Shut down the Mac. Turn it on and simultaneously hold the option, Command, P, and R buttons. Keep holding this combination for at least 20 seconds your computer should appear to be restarting. Contact Apple Support. If nothing helps, we recommend contacting Apple Support for further assistance. Maybe they could help you solve the problem with the USB ports. Hopefully, this video provided the information you were looking for. If you're using a Mac computer, we would like to suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. It will check your computer for malicious software infections and advertising supported software. The Disk Cleaner option will scan your computer for app caches, logs, downloaded files, and files still sitting in the trash. It will also show you how much space what files to take up on your Mac. Combo Cleaner will also help you look through all big files on your Mac and delete those you don't need. You can also scan Mac for duplicate files. Sometimes you might not know that you have a few copies of the same file. A privacy scanner that will help you remove cookies, cache, browse history and more. And an app uninstaller that will find all hidden app components and uninstall them for you. You won't need to worry about viruses and clutter on your Mac anymore. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.